Okay, welcome everyone. As we learn the Mishnah Yomis for this Monday evening, as we are dedicating Lili Nishmas, Rav Moshe Ben Rav David, L'Fur Shalem Afel Yom Moshe Mechai Yisar, for the Schuss of Rav Ram Yom Ben Ishbem Mark Yudas and family, by the Fisher family, Lili Nishmas Basi Bas Rabbit Shlomo Ben Avram Alevi, Peril Bas Ruvain. We also learn, dedicated by Mayor Yol Klugman and family, for their Gazun Panos and Nachas, Lufu Shalema, for Avigdor Ayyub and Rivka, and Mayor Ben Chaya Sara. We are in the third parak of Mesechtis uh, Kedushin. We're coming down the, the home stretch of the entire Seder Nashim. How, how exciting is that? As we learn tonight, uh, Mishnah. Ches and Mishnah Tes. And Mishnah Ches starts, Kidashti es biti. A father says, I betrothed my daughter. Or Kidashtia v'gerashtia. I have betrothed her and I accepted her get. Kishi Kitana. While she was a minor. Now when it says, while she was a minor, it's either while she is a minor or a nara. From 12 and one day to 12 and a half and one day. Those are the times that she is under his control. Uh, therefore, Naaman, he's believed. But if he claims I was Mekadosh and divorced her, or even if he just claims I was Mekadosh when she was a minor, Vari Gedeila, and now she's over 12 and a half in a day, he's not believed. And Naaman, because now she's not in his control anymore. Similarly, if he says, Nishbeis Upadisiya, she was taken into captivity and I ransomed her. Now, the nafkamina would be is that if she was taken into captivity, she would be forbidden to marry a kayin. He says I, I, he says I was taken into captivity and I redeemed her. Bain she kitana, bain she gdoyla, whether he says he did this when she was a minor, and of course when she was adult, ain't an emin. Because we give him nemonis with marriage and get, which he could accept on her behalf, but not for uh, the din of uh, being captured. Misha Amar B'Shas Misasa, if Ruvain says when he was dying, now Ruvain is not known to have any brothers. So therefore his wife, when he would die, is assumed to be mutalashuk, because she, there's no brothers that she should fall yibam. So Misha Amar B'Shas Misasa, if he said at the time of his death, Yesh Libanim, I have children, Neman. Because anyway, since there's no brothers, she wouldn't fall yibam anyway. But if he says at the time of his death, Yesh Liachim, I have brothers. Now, we don't know of any brothers. So now he wants to take her out of the Chazaka. Uh, until now she was Becheskas, Mutul now he, he says that there's brothers and therefore it's taking her out of the Chazaka. Ain't no nema. He's not believed. Hamakadesh is bito istam. If somebody says I'm accepting Kedushin on behalf of my daughter, uh, then all the daughters that are uh, minors or um, naras are a suffix if they're Mekudashis. But ain't a bigris bichlal. Any girl that's over 12 and a half in one day is not included because he has no right to accept kedushin on behalf of a girl uh, that's older than 12 and a half in one day. Now, the next question is in this Mishnah is if a person, when he says something, is machnis atzmaitli day suffolk. If a person allows himself to be entered in a case of a suffolk. We'll see the Rabbi Yaisi says that when a person says something, he means that which is clearly the meaning, where there's no doubt. While Ramea says a person might say something that has an ambiguity. So what's the case? What happened is, a person married a, a, a woman uh, when he was young, Yochevet, and then he married much later on, a wife later on, uh, in his older years, he married a young woman, and her name was Chai. So all of Yochevet's children are older than Chai's children. 
So me, she actually shtei banis. He has two groups of daughters, mishtei nashim from two wives. The Omar and he said kidashti es biti hagdail. I accepted kedushin for my older daughter. Now that's an ambiguous statement. If it means the oldest daughter of the older set, the oldest daughter of Yochavet, or maybe the oldest daughter of the younger set, of Chaya's daughters. Or maybe it means the younger daughters of Yochavet, because even the youngest daughter of Yochavet is older than the oldest daughters of Chaya. She gedailim and agedailim shebiktanis. Because even the youngest daughter of Yechavit is older than the oldest daughter of Chaya. So a man who says that a person might have said something ambiguous, Kula Nasurus, all his daughters are Asur, unless they get a get. Chutzmin Akhtanish Bektanis, except for Chaya's youngest daughter. Because Chaya's youngest daughter is not old, older than anyone. So she's permitted. But all of the other ones have an element of being older. And therefore, the father might have meant that girl. And therefore, they all need to get a get. That's Yipin Rameh. Rabbi Yaisi says a person is not machnis himself into a suffix. And therefore, when he said older, he meant the absolute oldest daughter. And that means the oldest daughter of his older wife, Yocheved. Rabbi Yaisi, I'm a kula mutaris, chutz min agdoyla shebegdoylas. Except for the oldest daughter of the older wife, Yocheved's oldest daughter. Because that's, he's not machnis himself into a suffolk. And therefore, when he said older, he meant the oldest one. Similarly, the other way around, vice versa. Kidash ti es piti aktana. I was mekadesh my younger daughter. Vein yoydeim ktana shebiktanas. If it's the youngest daughter of the younger wife Chaya, oy ktana shebigdoilas, or the younger daughter of the older wife Yochavet, oy gedoilas shebiktanas, or even the oldest daughter of Chaya. She ktanim and aktanim shebigdos, who's younger even than the youngest youngest child of Yochavet. So, all of them are usher according to Rameir because they all have an element of ketana, except kulon asurais chutz min agdailus shebigdailus, except for the oldest daughter of Yochavet that doesn't have any element of ketana. Diver Rameir. Rabbi Yaisi says if he said the youngest one, since he's not machnis himself lusafik, he meant the youngest daughter of the youngest wife. Rabbi Yaisi, I'm a kula metorais, chutz min aktana shibiktanis, because since ain't other machnis atzmai lusafik, when he said the younger, he meant the youngest one, and that's the youngest daughter of the youngest wife. Rabbi Yaisi, we want to thank you very much for joining us. Again, to remind you that the start time tomorrow night is at a quarter to nine, 8.45, and uh, have a wonderful evening.